Hey guys, it's Roslyn back at you one more weekend. I hope you are doing blessed on the Sensational Sunday. I know I am doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same for you. If this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome. Namaste and love and light to you and many blessings are yet to come. And namaste. And thank you for the support and coming to see what I'm about. And if you can, please do me the honor. Please like and subscribe. Even give me a thumbs up if you feel like you resonate with my video. And if you can be so kind, go ahead and hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And even drop me a comment. I love positive feedback. And if you are a returning sub, as always, thank you for the support. Love and light. Namaste. And many blessings are yet to come for you too. And love and light. And thanks for the support and the love. Today I'm listening to, um, it's like happiness frequency, it's for serotonin, um, what is it said, dwarfin, serotonin, dwarfin, uh, dopamine, and dwarfin release on 10 hertz by natural beats, and I'll go ahead and be putting that in the list down below too. Um, guys, my video is about Twin Flame 101. What's your spirit totem? It's like rise from the phoenix. Mine, I've, I've been seeing, when I've been doing these videos and on my journey, you will see, you will see animals all the time. You can go outside and you can look outside. Like when I first started, I started seeing cardinals. I started seeing cardinals and I started seeing, um, uh, blue jays and hummingbirds. And then I started seeing crows, and then I started seeing ravens. And then sometimes I would see a black swan, and or I would see two swans merged together, making a heart. And that's also in union. And then I also seen dolphins. I love dolphins. Um, I remember when my dad passed away, I was in, um, I was doing housekeeping at the time, and I found this ring. And you probably seen it on my finger, and it had um, a dolphin on it. And it was just so happened to be the same day. So it was just like, you know, when you start going through things, you will get messages from the spirit guides and from the spirit totems, and you will see different things like uh, owls. It's just like um, when you ask a question and an owl will appear to you, and it will be, um, it's just like something that you, you're not actually seeing, you know, or you'll see one dolphin. It's just like something that's unknown you need to be careful for. Um uh, swans are more merging together basically to tell you that's your twin flame let you know that uh, it's within union and it's with love it's like things are getting better and stuff like that so when you're going through things you know like I said Google is your best friend it's just like you know right after I made my last video you know I was feeling some type of way and I was uploading some more pictures for my thumbnails and then I had this vision and I heard the spirit guide say, you're rising above the phoenix. And I'm just like rising above the phoenix. The next thing you know, I seen the picture. And then I looked this up and I was just like, wow, this is a very powerful message. It's really good because um, it does with clarity, um, rebirth, uh, immortality. Um, and it's, it has something to do with the winter months. And it's just like when you're, there's a female and a male, and it's like you're the yin. You're the yin, uh, which comes out in the winter winter seasons, which is now, and then the the, the male uh, phoenix comes out during the summer months, and it's like a yin, and it's like a very powerful uh, or you know message or whatever. And I was just like, wow! And it was just telling me rebirth, renewal. Um, and I got this uh, written down. It's like clarity, uh, transformation, immortality, and protection. So I was just like, wow, guys, when, you, when you're going through so many different things, it's like I watch movies a lot. And it's just like, I, you know, I'll see dolphins or, you know, I'll see crows or something like that. And you, anytime you have questions about things that you're going through and you might see, you know, things come to you in many different ways. You can see, like I said, you can do it through sacredicity. So you're like 111-333-444-555. And then, you, you know, you, you'll start having these visions or um you'll start seeing them they also come to you through animals and you, you just never know the things that when when you're having questions about yourself you may not notice a lot of things it's like i see animals all the time and would never really pay attention to it until i start going through this journey and then i start looking for all these things the answers to my questions i'm just like you know can you send me a sign is it you know is it, there's things that i'm doing wrong am i on the right path you know you have a lot of questions about the things you're going through and basically the universe is sending you 
It's not like these big, you know, angels can come down and say, hello, um, well, I wanted to tell you this, you know, they don't want to freak you out like that. So they see you many different signs on communicating through numbers, synchronicities, and animals. So you never know. And it's just like people come up to you and it could be at the right time you really needed to hear something. Or you can be on a social media like Twitter or, you know, uh, uh, Instagram or Facebook and you might see a post that you know you really needed to hear at the right time or you might see you know a motivational video like you're coming to mind and you'll hear it at the right exact moment so um, I will be you know if I can find this video because I remember I seen it a few months ago when I was going through my transitions and everything about what animals that you know spirit totems that come to me and how they communicate with you so it's just like with the Cardinal, it had something to do with my dad. And then when my, my mom is also, my adopted mom has also passed away. I don't know if my mother, I my my biological mother has passed away. Um, but I know my mom came up to me, you know, through uh, the Blue Jay. And it was just basically letting, letting me know that they're there. You know, you'll end up getting feathers. You know, you can be walking outside and you end up finding a feather. And that's just basically, you know, letting you know that one of your, your loved ones is okay. They, they can be going through transition. And it's just to let you know that they're free of pain and worries. So you never know how the spirit guides in the universe is communicating with you. So, but if I can find a video, I don't know if I can or not, but I'm going to try. And I'm going to go ahead and post the link down below. So you may be resonating with uh, what I'm talking about just like hey you know I did see you know I might have seen I don't know even dogs could be you know a symbol to you so I really am not sure but I'm not you know I've seen dogs but, but I've never really looked that one up but I might need to um but you never know how the universe is trying to communicate with you and especially when you have answers you know you, you got so many questions and you need answers to because you might not be able you know when you're stressed out you won't be able to hear the messages so when they Usually, when they're trying to get your, you know, your, uh, your attention, and they can't really do it, you know, through synchronicities, they usually send animals to you. So you never know. You might walk outside and see a, you know, a cardinal come shoot down on, over you, or you might see, you know, an owl just, you know, just call and get your your attention. You never know. So, you know, if you have that that issue or whatever, I'm gonna go ahead and put the link down below, or if even not, you know, do that, you can always look it up on Google, like I said, Google is my best friend, <laughs> like my best friend, that's my best friend, so, um, guys, I'm not trying to hold you up today, this is like my third video, and I gotta get ready to head out, and I'm just like, gosh, you know, I've I seen this, so I had to go ahead and get, you know, a quick video, because like I said, when the spirit guy sends stuff to me, I go ahead and post it up to you, and go ahead and share the love, and push out that positive energy. And I will be posting the link of the meditation, you know, and it makes me feel really good. And, uh, you know, I have to have that zen for life, you know, just do the Tai Chi thing and all that stuff, which is very relaxing. If you guys, if you're up into meditation and if you know what Tai Chi is, it's like movement. And, you know, you, you deal with that, and that's very relaxing, too, especially when you're stressed out. And I got to, um, even now, even when you're stressed out and you just want to relax a little bit, you might have a little bit of anxiety or, you know, wound up too tight. That also works, too. And that was one of my techniques that I usually use, too. So I'm not going to keep you up today, as I said on my last couple of videos. So I hope everybody's going blessed and prosperous on this beautiful Sunday. And guys, keep each other in prayers. You know, we're losing people left and right. You know, these fires and these hurricanes and stuff makes me think about my dad's song, Seven. It keeps popping up in my head. So um, it's just a lot of things that's going on right now, especially, you know, when I hear that song, it resonates with a lot of stuff that's going on right now with the fires and the earthquakes and stuff going on so please you know be safe if you're on the west coast and in, in california area please and i'll keep you guys in my prayers um as always even if you're not even in the fire or whatever any kind of natural disaster i always try to keep everybody in my prayers and hoping everything is blessed and highly favored for you and if you can please like and subscribe hit that notification button even hit the bell when you uh so you know when i'm about to upload my next video and guys Stay prosperous, stay positive, and love and light, and namaste to you, and peace, and be wild.